Okay, folks. I hope you guys are having a good week. We got a Fender Squire here. Um, and I want to talk about how to set the bridge radius to match the fretboard if it's a compound radius. Say you got a 9 or a 10 to like a 14 where the nuts um, radius to the 9. And as it comes down, it goes to 14. How do you set the bridge? to get the right radius here. So, so what we're gonna do, so what we'd, we would do is, on a bridge like this, you got individual saddles that we can adjust. So there's two ways you can do this. So say, this is a, um, this will start at say a nine and a half, and it'll go to a 14. So what we wanna do is, um, one way of doing this, is taking a radius jig that is the same radius as the fretboard at the end of the fretboard and then you're just going to take this jig down and set it here and adjust each saddle to match that radius because you want the saddle to match the radius so at the, end of the, fretboard. the one thing I forgot to say about using this tool is the, before you set the radius at the saddles you gotta set the action the twelfth fret on the two outside strings to whatever you know 564 or 364 so once the two outside strings are set then you'll come back to the saddle and set going by the two outside strings set the four inside strings to match that radius with that now the other way we can do this is by taking one of these, setting the action at the 12th fret on the two outside strings, coming back to the end of the fretboard and measuring what the string height is on the two outside strings and then gradually take each string down. as you go across from whatever this measurement is. So if, say this measurement is 664 at the last fret and this measurement is 464. You'd gradually go from 664 down to 464 using either a tool like this or a ruler or feeler gauges. But you have to set the action of the of the two outside strings first, the high E and the low E strings, at the 12th fret, and then adjust it either with the um, ruler here or the radius gauge here. Now, if you have a saddle like this, it's the Tunematic Bridge style. These saddles come preset to usually a 12 radius and you can't adjust that radius at all on this. These are preset and the only thing you can do is change the height the pull bridge up and down. You can't change the radius at all. So these will come to match what the radius of the back of the fretboard is on a, a bridge like this. So there's no adjustment on that, just the height adjustment on that one. So that's about it. Um, thanks for watching my video, subscribe to my channel, um, like and comment on this video, and I hope you all have a great week. I will see you in a later video, and thanks for watching.